Hi, I hope you're well. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name's Rahma, and if you're old here, welcome back. I am glad that you joined me in this vlog, and I hope that you have a wonderful day. So, my goodness, this was in the city, so we did what the girlies do. We got coffee and we caught up. We hadn't seen each other for months, so there was quite a bit of life to catch up on. Hello, so in today's shenanigans, um, we're at this cafe and it's also a modest store and it looks super cute inside. The frequency that you see your friends kind of changes the deeper that you get into adulthood. It's just a kind of like a part of the process, but I just love when you have those friendships that no matter how long you don't see each other, things, they never change. They never oh change. Oh my god, it's so pretty and aesthetic. Um... Hello, guys. I'm not the, I'm not the cafe babe anymore. My friend just put me onto this really cute cafe. There was actually I saved ages ago, but um, she was like, "There's this place around the corner," and yeah, it ended up being really, really cute. Pinterest aesthetic. No, I know they missed me. What? So guys, the vlogs missed my my good sis. <laughs> Um, but yeah, we had like a catch up, soon come, soon come. <laughs> so we just watched the sunset, which is really aesthetic. Um, we're planning to have an actual swimming beach day. The water's cold. Whoa. My OOTD. Um, I'm wearing Lyra Swim and I like how it's just so comfortable but it's my first time wearing Lyra Swim and I must say I'm actually really impressed at the comfort comfortability of it but yeah we're at La Mer Beach and there used to be a lot of like nice shops and stuff here but there's like nothing here just just sand so if you're looking for the vibe of just chilling by the sea and the sand this area you're actually not allowed to swim which is why it's so quiet there's like families having picnics and things and over there there's like a lot of people sitting but if you want to come watch the sunset this is this is the vibes so i joined class pass recently and i love how you can try a variety of different exercise classes so if you kind of just wanted to switch up your exercise routine or try something new i would strongly recommend and also the class i went to that particular day was so lovely because the instructor was so sweet and encouraging and i also learned some arabic what did i learn yeah tickle afia that's the arabic that i learned with the day which just means like kind of like i hope that you have a good day or a blessed day or something along those lines so you take a lot of your tea too i decided to move locations because the other place that i was there were so many mosquitoes i don't know why but i got bored of fighting them off so yeah now i'm here yeah one blueberry match anything this part china really looks really cool because you mix it until it turns purple. It's currently Friday and a lovely Jum'a. Um, so I would I thought I would um, go to Jum'a and prayer, so that's what we're gonna do now. I don't know how hot it is, but it's very hot, and I am absolutely melted. That walk was long. In walking in this here, it's just it's, it's something. So now I feel really dazed by the heat. I feel like I need to just drink, hydrate, drink some water. I forgot how hot it's starting to get. Like for a while, it was kind of cool the weather here. 
like it wasn't too hot and it was really manageable and in the evening in the evenings i would say it still is quite manageable like it's not overbearing so now this to go this is super last minute i would like to say this is the most last minute i've been for a trip but it's not um i'm booking oman and i'm literally flying out tomorrow have not packed have not got anything ready my flight's in less than 24 hours first of all i haven't even booked my flight so let's start there my plan is to go for a few days and then come back because it's only an hour from dubai by flight and i've wanted to go for so long like so long i've had so much good things one thing is when i'm reading the day i have to read the date and the time like 10 times like i could not miss anything that's one thing like anything else i'll like skip over but when it comes to a flight i'm just like i think i have flight anxiety because even when i get to the airport i get there so early this one looks pretty good i'm on my way out things on my need list um and i buy under dress that's what i need i need a tripod because strangely enough i don't have one but i feel like i want one for a man and oh i need to fix I need to fix my camera and I need a black hijab and maybe another colored hijab and possibly an abaya like a travel kind of plain black abaya I'm currently on my way to meet my friends and they're running a little bit late behind me because of the traffic the traffic's currently insane in the meantime whilst I'm waiting for them I'm just gonna go around um, fix my camera, look for my tripod, do little bits of bobs and then yeah we'll see um, I'm not gonna lie, I might actually need to wrap it up real quick because I need to be home early in order to sleep before tomorrow Moisturizer. Morning and night. Yeah. Brightening serum. This one has salicylic acid glycol. So I just got a facial at Skin Laundry. My skin feels like I've only just had the treatment and my skin feels like it's actually glowing already. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. However, if you're watching this, this is your sign to get a laser. Um, a laser skin facial from Skin Laundry because my skin was feeling really really dull but now I feel brand new and refreshed okay I can say that was one of the best facials I've had it was so quick and I can already see a natural glow in my skin and i feel like as time goes on that's going to develop but i'm just so happy with the results and i really want to get it more regularly my favorite facials okay my favorite facials right now are hydrofacials no not hydrofacials actually micro needling okay funny story about micro needling if you go to a safe practitioner and a good practitioner you're all good however um somebody sent me a story i was so obsessed with microneedling last year i did it so often because my skin was probably the best it's been um i saw a video about these people and there were three cases from the same practitioner which was unhygienic which was reusing needles which is also unhygienic so maybe it's not the actual 
it's not the actual facial it, i think that was just a one-off because before that i've never heard of anything like this happening but three people contracted um, hiv from microneedling and it's kind of put me off but so i've moved on to um laser facials because i feel like it's given me number one it's given me the same glow and i've had really persistent dark marks so we're going to check in in a few days to yeah to see i feel like honestly i really do feel like i i don't know if you guys can see the difference but i can really see the difference but yeah um i'm at dubai marina and the clinic is just here behind me but also if you're not in dubai they have um, a branch in London, LA, New York, Miami, Arizona, Hong Kong, and Abu Dhabi, and Kuwait. So, uh, for my for my London babes, we're fresh and new and brand new skin. You already know where to go. It's actually ridiculously hot today, but <laughs> it doesn't actually look like it from my vlogs. But I don't get out much, so. Um, when I do get out, I like to sit outside in the heat and just, you know, just like melt. Oh no, no. I'm talking too much. Okay, but anyway, how about? Coffee, good. Vibes, good. Facial, 